I've always, I just wanted to be a head coach. I wanted to run my own program, get an opportunity to, to change lives and really impart upon the student athletes a lot of lessons that I've learned. And I think getting to do that as a head coach is just one of the joys of coaching. And it's just something I've always wanted to do and here I am. What it serves is a lot of lessons I've learned. A lot of coaches I've been around that have had more experiences and I take those lessons now and every time I've listened to a coach, heard a coach speak, been coached by someone or just been in a room with another coach, I take those lessons and those tools and I try and put them into my tool bin and then use them at a later time. So for me that experience is just helping me because there's different things that come up and I just try and grasp from that experience to take into what I can do now. Every week I talk about it, every day we talk about it, uh, I'm learning what it means to be a Raven. And the guys in the locker room are teaching me that every single day. And I'm learning from them just as much as they're learning from me. And week in and week out, we just keep preparing. And our biggest thing right now throughout the rest of the season and the season coming into the season with this staff and with the, the roster that we had is to being our best, creating a standard of excellence. And what does that look like? and just working on three things. We talk about accountability to your teammates, trust in your teammates, and commitment, right? And if those are the things, what does that mean? How are we gonna do that? And then be the standard of excellence. I think with the equity, inclusion, anti-racism, it's so important now, especially being at Carleton, is because the lessons that I've learned before and the education that I've gotten, I want to be able to pass on to my, my student athletes currently. And then even coming here at Carleton, seeing some of the work that they're doing here and some of the experiences that I've had at my previous post, um, I can bring them here and I'm continuing to learn and then hopefully continue to pass those lessons on to our student athletes. The main strategy for, right, for us right now and for the coaching staff, we want to get to learn the players, understand the players, but we also want to build a foundation, a foundation that is very rock steady and build that culture so that we can keep building from years on. And uh, what we've just been doing is just learning, learning each other, learning what works, what doesn't work, growing. And we talk about this as being a journey. This isn't an overnight thing that's going to happen overnight and it's not a sprint, it's a marathon. And everything we're doing is we're just building on our journey and laying that foundation this year. It's just learning, right? You go back to the film, you, you correct your mistakes. In every loss, you do some good stuff. And it's never as bad as you think. It's never as good, win or lose. And as long as we're learning from that, whether we learn from it right there and then in that moment, but hopefully going along our journey throughout the season, uh, we'll take those lessons and then we'll keep building on them and get to where we need to get to. Coaching is teaching, teaching is coaching and we're doing the same things. And I think teachers are some of the best coaches and some of the best coaches I've had have been teachers. And it just helps you understand the different learning styles, how to convey the information that you need to your players and understanding that everyone learns in a different way and how to best make sure that you can get that information to your players so that they can develop, learn, and then go out and perform on the field. We're gonna put a hardworking team out there that's gonna go out and fight every single game, every single play and put out their best effort. And that's all I look for from my players is just going out there, being their best, being that standard that we talk about every single day, never quitting and working hard. And the Raven fans can expect that from us, a hardworking team that's going to come out and show what it means to be a Raven.